Here's an update on our Butea cross Cyagris. And uh, so Butea is a pindo palm and Cyagris is a queen palm. Most of you palm knowers or growers know. Uh, I'm just gonna cut some of these bent pet little petioles off here. I'm just kind of trimming it up. It had a couple of brown leaves on it because it's so, or fronds because it's so dry. And uh, this one here I think is going into winter number three. Now, so it's growing in a very uh, dry area on a south slope underneath some big strawberry trees, eucalyptus trees, there's palms up in there, fatsia trees. Got even some cactus growing off to the edge here. But uh, you can see the center spear on it here. This is just an update. Center spear here. It looks good. There's the trunk on it. I'm pulling away the eucalyptus leaves, trunk is here. So uh, anyway, Stay tuned for more updates and we'll see what it does this winter. Just really depends how cold it gets, I guess. So it's more of maybe an experiment growing this thing out here. I did put a plastic bag over it last year and uh, it seemed to work pretty well, but no uh, artificial heat whatsoever. So that's Butea cross Cyagris, all right? Try one in your own garden if you live in a similar growing zone. It's a tropical looking palm and uh, pinnate species, so a feathered palm. All right, cheers.